In today's tech tip, I'll be showing you how to set up your brand new iPhone 16 by transferring all your data from your previous iPhone. So what you want to do is get your previous iPhone. For instance, this is my previous iPhone, the iPhone 15 Pro Max, and I have the 16 Pro Max and I want to be transferring all my data to this phone during the setup process. So the first thing you want to do is obviously turn on your iPhone 16 Pro Max. I'll have to get used to saying 16. So as usual, you get the Apple logo. Just waiting for the phone to boot up. There you go. Then you get your usual hello screen. Swipe up. Choose your language. Mine is English. And already you can see uh the older iphone has detected that there's a new iphone close by and it wants to be set up it's also going to prompt me to sign in with my apple id so what you need to do is just stop everything you're doing on the new iphone on the, and go to your old iphone and tap on continue you might need to scan your face and they're gonna get connected and you should see this little thing this uh, animation here so what you want to do is get your old phone and this is a qr code okay so just use your old phone and scan this on the new phone and they're gonna get paired and all you have to do now is just uh, wait And it's saying set up new iphone use your apple account so that's my apple id uh i'm just going to select setup for me it's going to ask for the passcode of your other iphone so this iphone's passcode enter it on the new iphone obviously i'm going to cover the camera to do that once you enter the passcode it should start the process now this is going to transfer everything it's going to transfer your password your Wi-Fi connections, your your apps, everything is going to get transferred. You can even see this is already connected to Wi-Fi because it picked up the Wi-Fi connections from this phone. So it says it may take a few minutes to activate your iPhone. So on this older iPhone, it says finish on new iPhone. Keep this iPhone near your new iPhone while your information is transferred. So here we can now continue by tapping on continue for data and privacy. You can scan your face for face ID. Or you can choose to set that up later. Now I'll choose set up later. And then it's asking transfer data from iPhone. If you're moving uh, from iPhone, you can transfer all its data and settings directly to this iPhone. So tap on continue. And now it's setting up my iCloud account. There you go. So you can see my name is already there. Of course, you're going to have to read and eventually agree to the terms and conditions by tapping on agree. And now it's going to sign me in and transfer all my data to the new iPhone. Now you can see there's a notification here that my Apple ID was used to sign in to a new iPhone. Just ignore that. And then on this new iPhone, it says, make this your new iPhone. Here's everything set up as you had it on your other iPhone. So we're going to have everything. Just tap on continue. Location services, you can uh, set that up later or you can turn on. Now I'm just gonna turn on for now for one reason. But that's, uh, completely up to you now we have the camera control tutorial that's gonna come up okay that's this new button which obviously apple doesn't want to call a button so click camera control to open the camera so just tap on continue it's basically a tutorial on how to use this okay 
you can just ignore that so we have apple beta program a beta software program do you want to continue taking part in shaping apple software by test driving the uh, release version of ios on this iphone now this mainly depends on person to person now i was using the beta program here so that i can get access to the latest apps first now on this new iphone i really don't want to do that i just want to use the current software that is available for everyone and then on this older iphone i can continue using the beta software okay so it's personal choice at this point so i'm just gonna choose don't continue beta program so it's going to ask don't continue uh, in the apple beta software program this iphone will not be updated with the latest beta software okay so don't continue beta program then we have the emergency sos press and hold for emergency sos we have all that i'll be making tutorials on all that so no worries and at this point now all you have to do now is wait okay so you can see data is being transferred from the old iphone to the new iphone in fact the best thing you can do is just make sure both iphones are actually plugged in and charging especially the one that's lower in battery so that this process can continue without any interruption now after this obviously i'll show you how to transfer your sim cards from the older iphone to the new iphone so for now we're just transferring data and setting up the new iphone 16 pro max so it says the time remaining is about 15 minutes so it might take time depending on how much data you have so just be patient and uh let it do its thing so when it's done it will let you know by saying transfer complete it took a couple of minutes for me and now i can now log into my new iphone with my old iphone's passcode and it says restore completed tap on continue again i'll set up face id later and then i can set up my sim card right now or i can set it up later so just select set up later in settings improve uh siri and detection dictation not now welcome to iphone and that's it so you can now see these two iphones look exactly the same now of course you'll have the option to erase the old iphone i'll choose not now because i really don't want to erase this one use this iphone when sharing a location And that's it. So now it's just going ahead and downloading and installing all the apps, but everything should look exactly the same. So you can see from this page, all the apps are aligned, including the wallpaper. Okay. So that is basically how to transfer your data from your old iPhone to your new iPhone. Thanks for watching. Comments and questions down below and good luck.